Hi, I'm Terry at Terry Hound Associates. Today I'm in Blacksburg, South Carolina, and I'm looking at a uh, small mobile home park. It's got some extra spaces, but I'm gonna tell you about the mobile homes. We own all but one of the mobile homes, and you can look at the list I provided. I have talked to some of the tenants, told them we're selling it, and uh, they'll probably have a new landlord October, November and just to be expecting what's going to happen. I'll tell you, I'm not going in every mobile home. Most of them are occupied. And just to say, you can look at the titles on them. We've got titles on seven, and there's eight mobile homes here. The vacant spaces, according to the city of Blacksburg, I put in a document for you, may not can be filled, but you can talk to the city. I think they give you a certain amount of time. Once one's empty, you got a certain number of days to fill it back and, uh, or you just forfeit that space. But right now, you are buying seven mobile homes and then there's an extra uh, space where the owner that occupies it actually owns a mobile home. But I'm gonna tell you about these that I see. Now, when you come out here, if you start on the right-hand side, uh, that's number one. It goes down and circles around and comes back. The end one's 13. So if you can see, take those numbers, we've got uh, got eight occupied, we've got five spaces vacant. You just have to maybe run for city council or something. All right, let's take a look around and see what we see. All right, I've, uh, I've been out here and talked to several of the tenants. Uh, number one's occupied. Two's occupied by a mother. Three's occupied by that mother's son. Number uh, four down there looked like, that's the white one with the rust top. That, I was told that one, uh, number four, I, that was a young girl I met, I would forgot. Number five, they're just renting the space. The occupant actually owns the mobile home. So, that's all you can get there. All right, then I'm gonna go down past it. We had, uh, there was a couple of spaces down here, power, water, and all that. Now you can talk to the city. I'm not telling you to put anything in here, but there's other power and uh, water. All right, number 10, according to the neighbors, occupied by a squatter that's in jail. So I can't do nothing about that one. This other one, uh, where number 11 would be, I talked to number uh, number 12. She's been here 13, 14 years, and she said nothing had ever been in that space. And this number 12, she lives here, she won't stay here, employed, all that. And number 13, up here on the end, the lady renting it, from what I understand, something leaked, washer, dryer, something, I don't know, uh, not a dryer, but washer, or sink or something, and it warped the floor. All right, that's gonna wrap up our tour to Mobile Home Park. Uh, I've talked to several of the tenants. They hadn't paid rent in a couple of years. There'd been some mismanagement. We went through COVID. Uh, but all of them want to stay and they're willing to pay their rent. Now we're paying 100 a hundred a week, but you can change it to monthly, increase the rent. I think there's opportunity here for that. Remember you'll own seven mobile homes out of eight and working on uh, filling the spaces, the vacant ones, I put you an ordinance and a, from the city of Blacksburg, you'll just have to talk with them, maybe run for mayor or city council, something like that get it changed all right i'm gonna move along it's a good opportunity it'll be a good investment for somebody i think you'll make a lot of money on it through the years and you got some good people here i met most of them all right read the story that i um that i wrote and try to explain what's going on with each uh, mobile home and if you uh, have questions or need some additional information give us a call our numbers at the bottom of the screen all right, look forward to seeing you and uh, hearing from you about this auction.